come from. On the uh, subject of the growing crews, uh, is it possible to move up to one of the bigger ships, mm -hmm. like the Allure or the Oasis? Is that enough? It w we could move into a larger ship, but it wouldn't make it any easier. Mm -hmm. Basically, the limiting factors for us as a group are the large venues, mm -hmm. and on the Allure and the Oasis, they're not considerably larger, particularly the Studio B and the conference center is actually smaller on those ships. Oh. So we would have the problems of moving to a larger ship, which is wrestling with an even, even larger number of non-US cruisers um, without any additional benefits. The back corner. The Quantum. The Quantum. Uh, the Quantum is is a, a new ship that I believe is um, being launched this year. In the fall. In the fall. Uh, it is certainly something that we have looked at. One of the problems with new ships is because they are new and novel, they don't have the, the they have more people cruise on it because it's the newest thing, and therefore they don't have the incentive to get groups on, and as such, they cost more, uh, significantly more. Right. In some cases. Even the uh, the Oasis class ships had to come down. You know, it's we look at that as well. So yeah, probably. and that that said, it is a neat space, and there are actually uh, you know we've looked at the brochures, and, and there are some very interesting spaces we may be able to, be able to use there. Although again, compared to this class of ship, uh, it, there are more limiting factors than expanding factors in a lot of cases.